Alright, as you can see, there is a huge horde chasing us right now. This is getting intense. What's going on everybody? It's your boy Toasty Sloth here. Today, we are going to be playing some State of Decay 2. For those of you that don't know, State of Decay 2 is a massive open world zombie survival game. You're able to clear out and upgrade multiple outposts around the map, recruit stranded survivors to help defend your base, and even upgrade awesome zombie slaying cars to do the most destruction. State of Decay runs on Xbox One and PC, so I highly recommend anybody who has those to jump on board and play this awesome game. While playing State of Decay, you're probably going to find yourself surrounded by zombies and having to run away quite often. The only downside to this is every time you sprint, or swing one of your melee weapons, you'll notice your stamina bar quickly diminishing. Once this reaches zero, your player will no longer be able to sprint, leaving you vulnerable to the giant hordes that'll surely be chasing you. To get around this problem, I'll be showing you how to turn on no fatigue, unlimited weight, and unlimited stamina. The combined effects of all of these mods will not only allow you to run forever, but also give you crazy agility that you've never seen. You can attack zombies faster than you've ever been able to, and you can also run just as fast as if you were carrying nothing, even when your inventory is completely full. This particular mod is only able to be done on the PC, so sorry to you Xbox One players. I'll go ahead and catch you guys over at the desktop so we can get this tutorial started. Okay guys, so now we're at the desktop, and these three files are all we're going to need to get this mod to work. First being the actual game, second being Cheat Engine, there will be a download link in the description for that, and also a table extension for Cheat Engine. This is pretty much just a preset little mod that Cheat Engine can use that works perfectly for State of Decay. I believe this specific table was created by JDimensional here at the State of Decay 2 modding Discord server. There's gonna be information in the description down below on how you can get this for yourself. But pretty much once you join the server, you just go over to the Cheat Engine tab, go through the chat history, and then you will find a download link. So again, all you need to do to do this mod is one, have State of Decay 2 installed on your PC, two, Download Cheat Engine, there will be a link in the description down below. And then three, download the cheat table, just as I showed you how to do from the Discord server. Though, there's a really good chance that there's also a download link for that in the description as well. So, go ahead and give it a look. So now to get the mod to work in game, all you have to do is start up State of Decay, then load up whatever save you'd like to play on. Once your game has loaded up completely, you can go ahead and head back to the desktop. Now we're going to go ahead and open up that State of Decay 2 shipping file, which is the table mod. All you have to do is double click on the icon. So I'm not sure what the best option is for this pop-up, but I've always just selected only when signed, else ask, and then I hit yes. So this menu is actually pretty big but the features we're going to be activating today are unlimited weight, no fatigue, and unlimited stamina. All you have to do is check mark all three of those features, then simply go back into your State of Decay 2 game and all of those mods will be activated. I'll quickly give you an example just by sprinting and take a look at the stamina bar. It stays exactly where it's at. You can run across the entire map and it will never drop. Alright, as you can see, there is a huge horde chasing us right now. This is getting intense. I don't know how I'm actually staying alive right now. It's really just because I have all three of those mods activated and it turns you into a freaking superhero 
you can run fast, you can dodge pretty much any zombie attack. Just look how easy it is to run from dozens of zombies. Without these mods, I would be terrified right now just searching for the closest car. And look, because I have so much stamina, I can use the power attack for every single swing. You can just push away all these zombies. It's no problem at all. Wow, that was freaking gruesome. Imagine how awesome it would be just to freaking fight unlimited zombies and never get tired. If you have State of Decay 2, you definitely have to try this mod out for yourself because it's super satisfying. But yeah, that was a quick little tutorial on how to mod your State of Decay 2 simply using Cheat Engine. Who would have ever thought that Cheat Engine would actually have mod menus involved with them? PC modding has definitely come a long way and has become a lot easier since when I first started. But yeah, I hope that these steps were easy to follow. And I hope all of you guys can get these mods for yourselves. But I'm gonna go kill some more zombies. This has been Tosi Slot. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day. And as always, I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.